Hello everyone, it is Andrea and today I'm coming at you with the new releases for this week. I have mentioned on Instagram a couple of times that the new format will be dropping in two weeks. So I have a lot of reformats over the next two weeks that I had done as like for future, but then I decided to change formats. So we're going to be releasing them all. So between this week and next week, I do have eight new collections or well eight collections coming in this current format so this week and next week both have three reformats and a new exclusive art set and i feel like both of them are like kind of insanely beautiful so there's going to be a lot of releases over the next two weeks so that we can hop right into the new format and any new art that i have seen i did sneak two before this video so there was like this really moody one and then a spring cleaning one those will come in the new format whenever i release that another thing i wanted to mention is is that all of the extras for the kits that are currently in the shop will only be available for the next three weeks so this release the next release and then the final release the release with the new releases uh, the new format, you can pick up the old extras, but after that I will be removing them from the shop because there are a lot more extras with the new kits and that is how we're going to be able to offer them. So that all being said, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments down below, but these releases will be available Wednesday at noon Eastern. Also, mystery spots will be available today if you're watching this on Monday at noon Eastern if you want to get in on March Mystery, which March Mystery I think is gonna be probably a lot of people's favorite kit of the year. I think March, April, May, oh, well, I don't know actually, because there's so many good ones, but I think March is gonna be one that a lot of people are gonna be searching for because it is beautiful and fun, and I feel like I've done themes similar to it in the past, but not exactly you'll get it when you see it but those other themes have always been like top favorites so let's get into this week's releases let's start at the top we'll save the best for last i'm really excited about the last thing um, both of the exclusive kits coming this week and next i'm so pumped for i don't think i've seen a kit i mean i haven't seen every kit that's ever been made ever it's just impossible but i don't think i've seen a kit in this theme or next week's theme i'm it's i don't think it's been done so let's go ahead and get into this week's releases the first thing that i wanted to show you was requested by a lot of people and i feel like whenever things are requested by a lot of people and i didn't think about it i'm like why why andrea why didn't you think of this but i am going to be adding this add-on for the brunch set and it is a graduation add-on it's very similar to the mom add-on just with like grad theming so you can make the brunch kit into a grad kit so that'll be added to the brunch listing and i'll put that in the new releases just so you remember like i did with the frozen one because i figured if i didn't put it in the new releases i personally would forget then let's move into the doodles for the week so let's go over the color of the week first i realize i haven't done a light green yet so this is the color of the week and it comes in the normal eight different sheets three four five six and seven and eight i have been using a color of the week every week i feel like even though we've only done like 14 or 15 i feel like i've done a color to match most spreads or like you know one of the colors so i've been loving it it makes pulling stickers a lot easier because i can usually pull at least a third of my like stickers from the color of the week then the 10 new doodles for this week which would be 461 through 470 is heb bag doodles ikea bag doodles this one is the takeout bag with no branding on it which is nice for like any um one that i don't have maybe something that's like more specific to your area and maybe you have a custom script that you want to put next to it it's just super cute and then that's in the regular colorway and then like a classic like gray then there is the music notes, which I mentioned last week in the Baby Shark kit. There was music notes on the sampler, so this is the regular colorway and then the neutral colorway. That was a request. Paw prints, dog food bowls or cat food bowls, and in two different colorways, and then the leashes as well, which were all requests from the Facebook group. I do have a lot more like custom ones coming, custom doodles. So if you have any requests, definitely head over to the Facebook group and look for that doodle post because I go on there all the time to see what y'all are saying and see if there's anything I need to add to my custom requests. Uh, the next thing we'll go through is the foil bundle for this week. And this one's really cool. I don't know if you're able to see. You can kind of see it there, but I'll go ahead and shine my light on it. 
it's like a square it's like a black hollow square isn't that so cool this would be really cool for like halloween or anything kind of a little bit more like 90s themed or grungy it would look really cool with that like grungy kit that will be coming in the new format it would actually look really cool with um march mystery right march mystery yeah the one that's coming up i think it would look really cool with that as a hint but like isn't that so cool i've never seen a foil like this in any other colors so when i saw it in the black i knew i had to like do something with it so this is in the star format, which I thought was really neat. It also could just look like black if you don't have like a light shining on it, which is nice. So it's really universal. So you have the six full boxes and header overlays, the two bougie box pages, the icons and the scripts, and then the bottom washi all having the star details. And how stinking cool is that? I just think it's so trippy. Or if there was like a matrix kit, I think that'd be really cool for this as well. So that is the foil bundle for this week. The matte label sampler is only available for, well, till through Monday. And it also will be on special pricing through Monday as well. Um, along with the color of the week, it's only available Wednesday noon Eastern until Monday. So the, that is the foil bundle for this week. I also have this new thing that I've been like kind of thinking about and having Kirsten prep. And we do do de-stash boxes and mailers probably about two times a year, but I thought it would be a, like a different idea to do a de-stash in shop that you can place with your regular order and you know use a coupon on or whatever you may and make it easier, especially because you could buy with other things. So this one here, I don't remember the pricing, but I'll, I'll put it down below. It's gonna be like really, really good. These are old foil bundles. I thought I just heard something. It's spooky when you hear something and it's late at night. So these are older foil bundles and it's going to come with five matte foil bundles and then also five of the clear foil bundles. And these are the older foil bundles that only have the one, two, three, four, five, six sheets in them. Um, so they are, you know, three formats old, but the price point I think was, let me actually just look it up. I always forget what I what it is and I should write it, but I always forget ahead of time. Let me see um let's see 4.95 for all 10 of these so really great deal plus you can put it in your order with other things you can use a coupon code if you have one this is an example bundle so you know you could get a different foil selection completely you could get some of similar ones this is just an example i know kirsten said there wasn't a huge variety of the matte ones left um but she tried to make a good enough variety throughout but like any other grab bag or misfit or de-stash if you order more than one we can't guarantee there'll be difference throughout just because um it is like a limited quantity thing and um we don't obviously check every single bag so if you order 10 of them we can't check and see if there's different ones throughout. So that being said, the nice thing about foil at least is usually like if you get like four silver ones, you can go through silver foil or even, or even copper or whatever. Um, it's easier to reuse than like, let's say a duplicate kit. Okay, let's get into the kits for this week. Like I said, there's three reformats. It is a lot of reformats over the next two weeks, but like I said, whenever I do like reformats, I usually do a bunch of them and then I spread them out as I need them through the weeks. But like I said, we are going to be moving into the new format, so I wanted to release these prior to that. So like the 4th of July one that I'm going to show you, I didn't plan on releasing it for a really long time, but we're moving into the new format. So this one here is Farmer's Market. It is a reformat of a mystery from last year, and I love this kit. It is so, so, so pretty. And I actually didn't get to use it last year because I kept being like, I want to use this when I go to the farmer's market. And I was pregnant and every time the farmer's market came around, I was like, I want to go early in the morning to meet the crowds. But I also don't want to get up early in the morning. But this year is the year I'm going to the farmer's market and I'm going to use it. And it's cool because I could use it in the newer format, which isn't actually that much different than the one that it came out in. But in the full boxes here. You have these two full boxes here. I think I switched out a color. I don't remember what color it is, but I think it might be the blue. I don't know. One of these was like a different color and I was like, let's change something up a little bit. So I think it might've been, I put the nude in here and there was a light blue. I think that's what it was. I think it just kind of gives it a little bit of a facelift. I feel like this would be really pretty with silver, with gold, with matte bronze. Those would be my top picks for it, but obviously there's probably plenty of foils that you can pair and make it look gorgeous. And then the extra in both the mini and the ultimate is the extra skin tone of the um, bottom washi page full box. 
This does come in a mini and an ultimate, as does all of the kits through this week. I think most always, they're always gonna come in a mini and ultimate. And then there is a 15 millimeter strip if you wanna add it on. There is the label sampler if you wanna add it on. I did do a label sampler version too. If you wanna bring out this red color or if you wanna bring out the original light blue color, super pretty. And then there's also the fashion add-on if you wanna add that on as well. So that is the first kit called Farmer's Market. This kit here has been requested a lot recently, especially to return. And I think this is the third reformat in each time. I have redone the boxes. It's just, it's just a gorgeous one. And this is another birthday kit. This is to infinity and beyond. And this was for Bennett's second birthday. Was it, I think it was his second birthday, right? Or is his first birthday? Second? Yes, second birthday. I love this art, but I did do some fun things with this. Since it was the third time around of me reformatting this, I wanted to give this kind of a lot more of a new life. Whenever I do a reformat of, you know, just like, one reformat it's i feel like it's okay if they're kind of similar but i wanted to kind of do something a little bit more special with this one because like i said third reformat so i am for sure using this again so you have your um eight full boxes here you have the four flat lay and the four non-flat lay um i did color change some things so also these make um a, a, a double box if you wanted to use those together um, but I did change some things. I really pulled out the pink and the navy. So I did color change like this B and the D to mat to be pink and blue. I did change this little stripe he or this stripe here to be pink. I changed these balloons to be pink and blue. The, I may have been this monkey I changed to be pink. Um, and then this, um, box here I changed to be pink because, oh, and then these make a, full, a double box too. You can see the little corner of this box here, but this will like line up. So you could have like two double box scenes of flat lace, which I thought would be cool. Um, but I did that because I wanted to bring in those to be the colors. So if, you if you've seen this kit in the past, the colors were the blue, not the, that one, this blue, the green, the yellow, and the red, which was a vibe, but I thought let's do something different. I pulled in the balloons in here, more pink and blue, just to give it more of like a Bo Peep vibe, but also it's still just like a really fun colorway. But I think it gives it kind of a new life. It really brings out the aliens in my opinion, which is super fun. Oh, I also changed the cupcake bottom colors to be blue too. I'm gonna mention that, but I think it kind of gives it a new life. If you already used this kit once or twice, I think it kind of gives it something different. I think there's a lot of fun foils you could really pull into this. There's that sparkly green in shop. Hold on, cause like this would be kind of life changing. So some of the foils I think will be really pretty with this. There's this sparkly green, which like, come on. It's in the twinkle format. It's like a sparkly green. Um, there's this blue hollow, which would also be gorgeous with this. Like a uh, stunning. And then there's also this blue like the navy color and stars. Um, this was in Twinkle, by the way. Um, but yeah, there's like lots of different colors I feel like you can pull into this. Or if you wanted to do something that I would do, I would grab a red so you could pull in the accents and then this would look really cool on top of the icons because it's not one of the colors in the kit. Or just go with silver or hollow or sparkly hollow. There's a lot of options here, but like this is gorgeous. I love it so much. And then you have the extra box here, which I think this these weren't in the first one or maybe they were. I don't remember if the fourth Toy Story was out then, but love the bottom Mashi, love the little toy soldiers in there as well. Um, and then the extra in both the mini and ultimate is the like has the more birthday icons in there. But I'm obsessed with this kit and I can't wait to reuse it. Like I said before, I don't really usually reuse kits too often, but this year I am. There's a lot of kits that I'm reformatting that I'm like, wow, like Love Potion, super excited to use it. Winter Mermaid, which I actually just filmed. This will be up later this week. Obsessed, I just used that last year, but I've been trying to give, you know, a lot of these reformats, especially on the third of New Life. So Ultimate Mini 15 millimeter strip the um, label sampler, the extra colors if you wanna pull in, the OG colors. And then you have fam one, two, three, four, five, and six. 
that is to infinity and beyond. Then we do have fourth, which like I said, it's very early for fourth of July art, but I already had this done and wanted to release it. Maybe you want to be super early prepared. So this is from the fourth art. This didn't come out last year, but it came out the year before. I don't think I reformatted it before, but I did change up the boxes. So it does have like a new vibe. I meticulously placed this glitter in here and I love it. I love a classic red, white, and blue spread. I will have a really fun foil that will foil bundle that will match this in the future really, really well, I think. But I love a kit with good food boxes. Let's be real. You have gorgeous fashion people up there, a double box scene, lots of food, and a food flat lay with lots of pretty desserts. I'm obsessed. I love the like picnic table cloth pattern. Those are the full boxes. Then you have your extra boxes. You have a balloon box, which I think those are always perfect for foiled quote overlays, a super cute little outfit with an, a cherry pie on top. Love the classic 4th of July colors, patterns, bottom washi. I love it so much. Again, perfect one for a quote. And then the doodles are the freebie in both the mini and the ultimate. I just love this kit. And I feel like these two fashions were some of my favorite the year that this came out. I just think they're so cute. I love their hair and their like little outfits. Comes in mini kit as well. 15 millimeter strip. Label add-on. Fashion if you want to add it on. And also another fashion. And I love these ombre hairs that I just like kind of whipped up real quick. Thought it'd be fun to do like a blue. And then this one has kind of like a balayage ombre moment. So that is fourth. And then last but not least is new art. And I am obsessed with this kit. I feel like Jess Kitten and Jess killed it. This is exclusive art. So you won't find it anywhere else besides SPC. And I have wanted a kit with this art, like this theme, for so long. And I am so excited about it. And I think a lot of y'all kind of know what it is. Probably based on like seeing it. But also I have mentioned that there is Planahanna overlays that I want to use with this kit. <sighs> this is called Captain Jack and I am in love. I love Pirates of the Caribbean. It's such a good movie. I did watch it recently too, so maybe you might have picked up on that. I just watched it randomly like during Christmas time when I was doing the mood board, but I love this kit. I feel like Jess killed it. You have the beautiful characters. You have this hand that I thought was really cool with like a night sky background. You have a lot of different like prop elements in here that are gorgeously done. And then you have the rum and Jack's hat. Gorgeous scenes, both dark and light, which I think is fun. The like ship in the background here. <sighs> I mean, come on, it's beautiful. It's beautiful and I love this movie. You have two extra scenes here, the pirate ship with the moon, and then you also have that kiss scene, which, oh, so good. I also love the colors in this kit. I think they're really nice and muted, but they still match the um, boxes and then the patterns in this are also so fun but like let's talk about foil I feel like you could do silver I feel like you could do gold I feel like you could do a mixed metal I feel like if you had like a matte silver that'd be really cool but I think a good choice would be matte bronze if I wasn't using those plain hand underlays which actually I might order those in black I feel like black pirate ship underlays Hannah's gonna be like do you need another order Andrea do you need one I just placed three over the past like couple of days but Maybe I'll buy those in black and then use matte bronze. Like, is this kit not calling for matte bronze? And look at these patterns. So you have like an ocean pattern. You have the like skull and little um, sword situation. This like looks kind of like old paper. And then the pirate ship boat map situation. And then look at this bottom washi. Look at the bottom washi. I don't think I've been this excited about a bottom washi. I really love the Lucky Charm bottom washi. But this one... <sighs> whenever I was watching the movie and like they have the scene where they're like have the treasure chest open and you see all of the coins in it I knew I was like I need a paper of this so I wrote it in just killed it and then the extra box here is the pirate flag with like the moon and stars in the background and then the uh freebie in all, both the ultimate and the mini kit is the doodle freebie <sighs> let me know what you think in the comments down below let me actually show you the underlays that I'm talking about just in case you want to go grab those where are they right here okay maybe I don't have them anywhere near me mm, are they in here 
Y'all, this is like the kind of life, the unorganized life that I live. Are they in here? I really want to show you these. Might end up just like putting a listing picture on here, but I think I'm going to order them in black because I think that that'd be a vibe. Y'all, I have an overlay problem. I don't know where they went, which is kind of interesting, but you know, I'll find them eventually, but I'll probably be ordering them in black because I think that matte bronze is the way to go. But I'll try to remember to put like a little, I'll put, I'll put a, a link down below for you because I think that's like the way to go. So that is everything. Um, I hope that y'all, oh wait, I didn't show you. 15 millimeter strip and label sampler. Who want to add those on? That is everything for this week. I am so excited for this week's new releases, next week's new releases, the new format. I just, oh, it gets gets better and better every week. I'm just so pumped. So again, we have Captain Jack. We have Fourth. We have Two Infinity and Beyond. We have Farmer's Market. We have the D Stash Foil Bundle. Bundle. We have the Black Square Hollow Situation in the Stars. We have the Grad Add-on. We have the Color of the Week, and then we have the Ten New Doodles. I'm out of breath. I need a drink of my juice box, but let me know what you think in the comments down below. Otherwise, I'll talk to you in my next video.